Good morning guys, welcome back to our video. Welcome to today, today is a Monday and it's the first day after our holiday, so that means homeschool. Whoa. Yeah, homeschool is in the works. Homeschool, Sophie is dutifully doing her schoolwork and Gabby is dutifully cleaning. cleaning her dog leash with toothpaste. I told her toothpaste works. I don't really know, but I think it does. You gotta scrub, 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 scrub. She actually has this adorable little dog collar and I think that this will fit her puppy when she first gets it. Not Cinderella. Yeah, she's not Cinderella. She's actually like a regular school girl. Guys, look at my snack thing. Okay, so we'll leave her doing that because she still has all day to finish her schoolwork. She should be doing her schoolwork instead though. So our snack thing is working out well. Sophie has some carrots. She loves them. Don't worry. And a pear. These are not full. It's not full. Yeah, and that's her junk snack today. It's just a tiny bit at the bottom. That's her junky one. How are you liking our bucket system? I hate it. Hate this. Love this. Love this. But how do you like the system? Like having three snacks every day? I hate it. <laughs> Why? I want to eat these every single day. And I'm glad... Because it showed me that I love these carrots. Yeah, carrots are good. I think so too. Do you use dip for them or do you just eat them plain? Plain. Oh, good job. These ones taste good plain. Good job. Plus we have no good dip. Mm, we have like amazing spinach dip. So what I do you want instead? Um, dip. Ranch? Yes. Ew. I don't know. Today is back to school day and I had a lot of plans today, but then this happened. Yeah, it's true. It snowed out snowed out and in fact it is still snowing out and I literally am at the end of my wits about the snow like you think being a Canadian I'd be used to it but we had such a nice reprieve from snow and I was really getting into it and I'm just tired of it like I don't even want to go outside today I'm that frustrated with it it's supposed to snow the whole day as frustrating as it is the only thing that you can do when the world hands you lemons All you can do is make lemonade. Let's make the best of it. Let Sam go out and do all the work today in the snow. And then tomorrow, when the snow's gone again. It's gonna snow tomorrow too. It's not gonna snow tomorrow. I looked it up. I looked. I Guys, no. no. You have to eat something healthy. Get carrots. Yeah, so he is a poster girl for carrots. Okay, so you guys know how there's a coronavirus out there and everybody's on lockdown. You are still allowed to go shopping and Gabby and I are dying to go shopping to buy stuff for her puppy. Like, she wants to go to the store so bad. And you are allowed to go shopping, but I feel like shopping should be like essential shopping, not like actual shopping because I'm really scared. I don't want anybody to get sick in our family, especially Sophie and Sam. So. And I don't care about the coronavirus. Yeah, because she's 13 and- Because I eat dirt all the time. Yeah, her- like candies from the dirt yeah. in the arena. Yeah, it's true. If something, if there's candy and it falls on the floor, she eats it. Yeah. Yeah, future boyfriend, I'll be saving this video for you. Okay, so we did end up going shopping for her puppy and she's gonna do a haul video very soon. I don't know if it'll be on her channel or our channel, but- Probably um, mine. Things <gasps> oh gosh. Okay, so. All right, she almost spilled her drink. That's a great start to the video. It's a great start to the video. But anyway, so we ended up shopping on Amazon. So we're gonna show you sort of what she bought. Um, and if you guys wanna comment something else, any kind of other essential that we need, um, comment below so that I can get it before her before everything starts coming in so that her video is complete. One thing she wants to get that we haven't got yet is a tag. What does it say? Oh no. Oh wait. Just wait, uh, can't I you remember? it on my phone. You can't remember it? I can't. Oh my goodness. This is the girl that remembers everything. Even I can remember it. Well. <laughs> okay, so it says. Crap, I'm lost. Call my mom, she's ugly crying. And then your phone number goes under it. Yeah, that's what she wants. Oh no, I'm lost. Call my mom, she's ugly crying. Cause that would be me. And it's gonna look like that. Yeah, so we're gonna order that if we can order it, but um, if not, we'll be getting it soon. So what I did was I signed her in to my Amazon account on her phone and then she saved things to my favorite and then we went through it 
and we shopping bought cart. yeah to my shopping cart and then we went through it and it turned out that everything she wanted and the things I thought she should have turned out to three hundred dollars and then I'm like no nope. <laughs> go through it again and take some stuff off so then we took a bunch of stuff off and then we I took added a couple more things <laughs> It came to three hundred dollars, so I guess that's what this puppy needs. These are things that she got. She got some Chuck It balls. She got also this um, rubber rubber ball that is good for like putting treats in and stuff. She got a little bed. Um, reset. Thank you. She got a little bed for the crate, which I think might have been a mistake by because um, I don't know if her. It's an 18 inch pink dog bed. I don't know if her crate is 18 inches. It's a small crate, but she is getting a bigger crate So I figured she might as well have it. Then she got um, Two leashes. We'll show you. No. Yeah collars. Oh, yeah two collars one glow in the dark because he thought that would be super cool no, One lights up. And yeah. The other one yeah is one lights pink. up. Yeah. Okay, and Gabby you got, tell them um, a dog bowl yeah, we got a dog and feed and water bowl. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the thing that I saw an ad for on Instagram, um, when you're out walking and you have to give your dog water, it like holds your water and yeah. She also got this entire dog rope toy 12 pack. You can't really see it. She will be showing it. It comes with toys and ropes and like a whole lot of chewy tug of war. Oh, there we go. So and she the got carrot. yeah she got all this stuff like a frisbee ropes tug toys she got a super awesome extra large squeaker ball it's extra large are you guys still noticing a trend in the color um it is one of those really soft plushy beds so that when she's like just in the house we got her that and it's pink last but not least she got the chuck it stick because we have a lot of property and she is thinking that she's going to want to throw the balls so that she can run and catch them. I think there was one more thing that's not coming right away. Okay, so um, that is what we got to start. There are other things that she wants to invest in. Like as she gets older, like when, after she's a year old, she's going to get some jumping stuff. Like there's like a dog um, jumping thing that she can get. We actually have a dog agility set but it was not very good so she's probably gonna get another one of those she'll probably get an agility set for her for that for her like lots of good christmas presents come in you guys um for the puppy but anyway that is it what else do we need um i try to cover everything we have pee pads but i don't think we're gonna need those i don't know i cannot think of anything else so comment below if you guys think of something else what are you most excited to do with your puppy i don't know have it cuddle her play with her train her what's like the biggest Play, yeah. Play and train. Just having a poor colleague. Yeah, so exciting. I want a trainer to do all these tricks. here miserable and gross and disgusting I feel bad for the horses but we just gotta get through it just gotta get through it this is a new addition to our barn though soon hopefully we're gonna get our sand in I gotta call them and see what can happen in isolation um, so basically it got a little wet but it fits perfectly this is the new couch that we're gonna use in here for sitting for when I can sit down here and watch the girls play all summer because I suspect it's gonna come to that I suspect it's also snowing in the arena right now hey Gracie yeah I love her Sam is spreading hay excited about um, uh, the time that we can use our jumps again and set stuff up like I'm excited so uh, Sam's gonna go get hay we need hay for our barn actually I didn't check how much hay we had sometimes I think he just likes to get out of my house <laughs> uh, oh yeah we are out of hay completely out of hay call Sam anyway the way that our, our hay 
works is that he calls ahead, they have a drop box, they put the money in and they go out and put the hay out for us. He put, goes there, puts the money in the drop box, takes the hay, so there's like no mixing of the virus going on, even with hay. It's supposed to be above zero today, like one and two degrees above zero, so the snow should be melting, it better melt. We drove down though, because you know, one week of no snow and we've forgotten how to live in it. That's exactly what it's like. Like, it's just so miserable. Like, go away. Okay, so Sam and I are headed out to nowhere because you can't go anywhere. <laughs> anyway, we are, Nick, like I told you guys yesterday, Nick and Jesse both still work. They're essential services because they work with food. And so both of them still have to work even though Jesse is, even though Jesse is almost five months pregnant. It is nerve wracking. They can't take them to any daycare. They can't take Jack to any daycare because all the daycares are closed and yet they both still have to work. So, so obviously the only people left to take care of him are us. It is nerve wracking because I don't want to introduce any kind of risk to my family, but I have to do what I have to do to keep um, everybody safe. Jack and us and Jesse and Nick and everyone. So I'm gonna go and babysit Jack and Sam's gonna take you guys with him and put the horses to bed and finish the rest of the day. So you guys are gonna get to have Sam vlogging and Gabby and Sophie vlogging because I'm gonna be away. And the best thing about this is that Jack is gonna go to bed at seven and Nick gets off at 10. And that means that I am gonna get three hours all to myself. I brought a really good book. I brought Jack some cheese and some raspberries and blueberries. These are all of his favorite Nana snacks. So I'm all set. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Ready to come in Willow? Hey guys, it's still snowing out. Raining. Snowing. A little bit of snow, a little bit of rain. It's all good. Hopefully it'll be gone soon and summer will be here quick because we need to bring our horses home and I don't want a, I don't want a muddy field. That's what's going to happen when we bring them home. They're going to run around the field and if it's raining it's going to be pure mud and that'll be terrible. Holy geez Willow, you're soaking wet. You ready to come in? I need to get you hay. Let me get you some hay. So Gabby likes to bring the horse in with the lead rope and I know uh, she's gonna get in trouble by her mom. That's what's gonna happen because I like to use the halter on the horse. It's a hard time putting on her halter all the time. So I say we put on her halter all the time. It's very easy for time. me to put on her halter. It's not easy for us to put on her halter and that's why we need to do it more. It's easy for me. Comment down below what do you think the safer way obviously is with the halter but Comment down below who's right. Not when the Me gets stuck or on Miss Thinks She's Right Pants. That's it for today's video. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.